curious. You are eager to know why you were spared. Yes. Do you have faith in me? I want to. Good. For now, all you need know is that we are going to meet my son. Rathma, the first necromancer. He is that, and more. He is the key to my plans. It sounds like they're searching for Lilith's son, Rathma. Together. Mother, what are you thinking?
Wait. What? right now. She must be. Go. Or stay. It is time to choose. I... I trained her well. She's a good kid. Strong. She'll be alright. She... You've chosen well, my child. To reach Rathma, we will need to cross a lake at the bottom of these ruins. It requires a ritual. I will teach you. As you wish, Mother. Good. You're ready for lesson one. Blood is the key. What did you see this time? I don't need sparing. Tell me. Lilith plans to teach your mother a ritual. One that needs blood. Your mother seemed... receptive. We have to reach them.
of magic as before. I think I can dispel it. Never enough blood. I will follow you to the ends of Sanctuary, Mother. A priest. He must be from the escort. There she is. Hmm. 
Mother? Nerel? You're just in time. Beyond this lake lies the necropolis of the firstborn. A trove of magic and knowledge. I opened the way for Lilith. But I could not pass through with her. I... I lack divine element, you see. Stop. But I can find it. I'm so close. I simply need... Mother, stop! Look at what Lilith has done to you. You're writing in your own blood. My little magpie. She awakened me. She showed me things... I can't even put into words. Once I've finished, you will understand. I don't care what she showed you. Please, let's just get out of here. <laughs> oh, I see. Yes, clever magpie. Trying to lead me away so you can take all this for yourself. Hmm? <laughs> this is my discovery, not yours. I will finish these rooms with your blood!
ready yet. to make Lilith pay for what she's done. So we need blessed blood. Go back to your prava. Get that blessing. Beg if you need to. Whatever it takes. My mother started this damn ritual. I'm going to finish it. Meet me in the Mistral Woods. Why there? The Haradrim hid a vault there. Finding it was her life's work. So much for that. Maybe it will help with the ritual. If not, at least I can bury her where she'd want. I need time. I'm sorry. Just leave me. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. Since I can't let... I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God! I can't hold these levels. We're losing it! But help us! Integrity at risk. No! No! 
All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We're under attack by an unknown enemy force. Fall back to Marine HQ to regroup. I say again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Squad leaders, give sit reps. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo Team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. We are pinned down in Alpha Land. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Main power systems down in sub-level. Backup and life support systems only. We've got lots of civilian casualties. It's a mess. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area. Report directly to Marine Headquarters and await further orders. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production dated October 18, 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel to keep up with demand. The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain our equipment. Okay, I don't know what is going on over in Delta, but I'm doing all I can down here. The constant demands are bad enough, but the rumors going around are making things a whole lot worse. And I gotta tell you, things don't get better soon. All hell is gonna break loose.
All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We don't know what we're up against. Repeat, we have negative ID on the assailing force. The mean SOP. We don't have a clear path back to HQ. Stock up on ammo, establish a stronghold, and keep them at bay. That 5 2 2 Fall back to the nearest station and set up a CP there. Out. This is Sergeant Kelly. Fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Remaining Marine units. This is Sergeant Kelly. I am unable to reach Mars City from my current position. Move to Marine HQ to regroup and await further orders. base. People started changing. It was crazy. I, I was working up here on the vent shafts. I don't know how I survived. Go for help. Please. This is the audio. This is Mark Stanton, Manifest Controller, currently stationed at Mars City. I'm not sure who to send this to, so I decided to send it to quite a few people. If you're on the recipient list, please take a moment to review this report. It is quite important. I'm very concerned over the shipping procedures out here. I am the Manifest Controller, and as such, I need to be informed of everything coming in and out of Mars City. Someone here is subverting my position and preventing me from getting data on Man, things being shipped. This is, this is unacceptable. They're all dead. Not I'm only really could this reflect what poorly on my upcoming Over. review, but this is my job and I'm tired of being out of the loop. Stay sharp, son. Look I have no idea who keeps telling the shipping crews to allow no things mind. in and out without allowing me to produce or procure the manifest. But whoever it is, it must stop. One of the dock workers actually told me to piss off when I tried to stop one of the last containers 
from going straight to Delta. I immediately filed a report and will follow up with the transit manager next time I see him. End of log. Audio log for Dr. Cassian, currently stationed at Mars City. I have just left the weekly status meeting here in medical. The most prominent topic was the vast number of psychological issues we are seeing as of late. The number of reports indicates that 10% of the overall base personnel have shown symptoms. As many people will not come in for this type of thing, the number of affected personnel could truly be in the 30 to 40% range. It has even manifested itself here in medical. We uh, have several nurses and a couple of good doctors out for related reasons. I'm going to formally request two additional psychiatrists on the next shuttle from Earth. The two we have are being overworked, and the content of their sessions with patients is starting to affect them. Dr. Casey now. You're still alive. I'm unable to return to Mars City. All passages out of the Delta complex have been blocked. I'm setting up a command post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head toward Alpha Labs. It's the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good job, and good luck, Marine. Thank you. 
This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Bernays, dated November 10th, 2145. I fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, I distinctly heard whispering. When I went to investigate the sounds, I found nothing. I checked the work logs and I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. That experience, coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over in the Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off, the mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. I'm always expecting someone to jump out at me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance elevator. Technicians should use cabinet code 396 to access them. And the vlog. Audio report on troop morale. Morale here is beginning to drop. It's nothing to worry about yet since I keep my marines sharp and ready to go, but events at the base are wearing on the troops. There have been a lot of things happening here on the base. I believe the UAC experiments being performed here must be the cause. Out here, they could be experimenting on God knows what. There are quite a few people missing, and no marines of course. It's the civilian population I am referring to. Bottom line, Whatever it is they have going on here has my men on a racer's edge. At this point, there is no cause for alarm, but I am requesting we rotate squads every 90 days instead of every 180. I will continue to report as the situation develops. It's good we have the new Marines en route. Fresh faces will help. Sergeant Tyson, out.
Any operational sentry bots, use them. Those guys pack a lot of firepower. The UAC is here to help you. Psychological services are free and confidential. Bravo team quick. They need all the firepower they can get. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. 